Good morning. I just got a package from Yastel and it's a new wig and new lip tints. It's a new year now. I want to film a reset, reset glow up kind of vlog. This is the lip tint I've been wearing for three years now. It's number 14. I decided to grab a new one called Better Orange for this year. Maybe it might be a little bit different. Maybe this is my new tint for this year. I love orange lips. I'll link it down below. First off, I really love the color. So it's a super straight hair wig, which I've never done before. Okay. Oh, it feels so nice. I just love brand new wigs. They always feel so nice. This one was a pink age wig. It's kind of heavy, but it's actually nice quality. And it was one of my more expensive wigs. So I'm going to keep her and maybe you guys will see her during the fall season again because I think it's so cute for fall. But we are entering spring now, so... Like this. I love this length. I've never done this length before with the wig. Pink age is really good quality, but I always feel like 7Q is not that bad for being like way cheaper. So yeah, I'll link this one down below as well. I got a new camera for the vlog channel and this isn't anything fancy. This is literally $40. I actually charged it last night. But yeah, it comes with an extra battery. And it's a like vintagey camera, guys. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, let me get a shot for you guys. This is my first time ever filming anything on this camera. Okay, I'm filming on it. Hello. Welcome to Julie Julie channel. Okay, so yeah, that's my new camera for this year. I really want to capture beautiful moments this year. I'm so hungry. This is what it looks like. Cheers. Madam Glam, they sent me their gel nail set. It comes with the LED light. Ah. They let me pick three colors and then it comes with the top and base coat. This is how the LED light looks like. Has the goes like okay. So first I'm actually gonna use some sunscreen on my hands. Last time I did my nails in Korea, I I feel like I got a freckle after doing my nails for four hours straight. Freckle right there after doing my nails. I had a really tough choice choosing which one I wanted to do today. I actually asked my jewels on my Instagram. Basically 90% of you guys said pink. So I'm gonna go for pink, perfect white. This one called Oh My Brown, but today we're gonna go for... So this one is called You're So Vain. They're semi-permanent, so I don't have to worry about it chipping. This is not sponsored. They just wanted me to try it out. And yeah, they have a coupon as well for my jewels. It's going to be juliej30 underscore one. The really like... Wait, it's been like a couple minutes. I don't understand why, but I feel like this is like not really drying the base coat. I think I did the coat too thick. I don't know what to do. I feel like I'm not a girl because I don't know how to do these kind of stuff. I don't know, why is it still tacky? Oh, why is it doing that? Oh, it's getting messy. It reminds me of baking. Okay guys, I finished my nails. They turned out really bad because I think I messed up in the beginning when I did a really thick coat, but I do really like the color. I'm so in love with you You just help me
I'm just gonna watch a Korean drama. I haven't watched Korean dramas in a long time, but I started watching this one called Legend of Blue Sea. By the way, I just wanna say thank you to my jewels for all the comments you guys left on my previous vlog. Like, I was really embarrassed to upload that video. I'm really glad I did now because sometimes embarrassing things happen in our life. And that's normal. I feel like last year, I kind of started to forget like why I was doing YouTube. It's like I remembered again, so thank you guys so much. Anyways, this is so easy to make and I love udon noodles. If you guys don't know, if you guys are new here. So like this scene, she's like all by herself. She's kind of used to it, so she's not upset. It's just like her life, but then like he showed up. I just wish like someone showed up for me like that. It touched my heart. I feel like in my life when I wanted someone to show up, at that very moment, it would be kind of impossible, right? Life is not like a K-drama. By the way, the main actress in this drama has a mole on her nose. In Korea, if you have a mole right here, it means you're really pretty and she has that. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm sad. I think this mic is broken. And I just barely bought it last year, as you guys saw on my vlog. I don't know if you guys know what's wrong with my mic. Just let me know, because it sounds like this. I don't know what happened, so I'm just going to take it off for now. Bye. Okay, my desk is a mess, and this is all literally just from today, so... Okay, this table's clean and now this table's clean. Yay! In my house, we do not use the heater. I learned that from a very young age. It's like a waste of money, so we just cover up in blankets. But my feet are always cold, so boom i want to show you this cute thing i just got from jisoo live they sent it for me to try it is so cute so i couldn't refuse it doesn't it look like a giant boot but actually it's a foot massager and warmer just plop this on like that and then i just like edit all night so i'm gonna turn it on and it takes only three seconds to warm up or you could have it on massage mode which is like that it's massaging my foot right now. They also had a pink one, but I feel like this green matched my room aesthetic more. Again, it's by Jisoo Live. Not sponsored, but they wanted to give my jewels a coupon. They have a discount code for my jewels as well. It's Julie20 and it's valid until the 19th. So. Pink coat, but I do really nostalgic. Guys, I love how the new camera looks like. It's so like cozy and homey. Like home video type of video. They wanted to get my jewels in my house. We do not use the heater. So the chairs, and pillows, he's on black and white.
<laughs> I bought this for my air fryer. I like this, so it's like way more convenient. So cute. I'm just gonna have coffee on the side. Oh. Mm, it smells so good. Oh, so crispy. Mm, there's custard inside. Okay, I'm done waxing. I'm gonna put on makeup and then we're gonna go buy my phone. I haven't worn this jacket in so long. I think I'm gonna use this tote today. Yeah. Sunscreen. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, it's so pretty. This might be my last day with this phone. Because I could trade it in and get extra credit. Mm -hmm. Anyways guys, I bought a new iPhone. I feel like buying the newest iPhone is so out of my character personally. iPhone 7, I've had it for 3 years now. The battery is really bad now. My storage is like always full so I needed to upgrade on a lot of things. And also because of the camera, I decided that iPhone 13 is probably worth it compared to like the older. And also my phone carrier was doing a deal so I saved a little bit of money. But I still have my iPhone 7 because they had to order it. They have a blue one, the gold one, a pink one, and a white one. So let me know which one you guys think I got. Okay, I finished half of it. Okay guys, I just finished exercising. And I picked up these today. I got really inspired by the YouTuber Sandy Diana Bang. And I also have scissors. I just went on my Twitter and screenshotted a bunch of uh, quotes that I retweeted. Just so that it would all be like the same font. So work smarter, not harder. Okay, so I have this picture of bread because I just really want to manifest pretty and delicious food in my life so I have this next I have this like really aesthetic room I think it's a good inspiration pick for like my room I even have the same chairs I'm also just gonna go ahead and add the year right now I follow this girl on Instagram so creepy but I printed out this picture of her I just want to have more moments like this so boom this picture of a plane I want to travel at least once a year because I really want to move into my dream apartment this year so you guys I have this picture of Korean food and yeah I want this more in my life I want to be able to eat a lot of delicious foods I feel like this picture represents like the kind of friendships I want like, it's very low-key but like it's just like a friend group enjoying the city view together and I think I just want to have more friends to enjoy things with. I really want to read more this year or just like become more educated and learn more things in life. Speaking of like meeting new friends and stuff, I just want to talk about, I just want to talk about the situation that happened in my vlog. The best way to explain it is that I have standards. Standards are so important guys. It's basically your way of telling people how you should be treated when i used to not have standards people treated me so bad and i don't regret it at all i could go back in time talk to 
younger me, I would have told her that walk away from a conversation, a situation, anything I simply don't like. The reason why is when I stayed in those situations, I really ended up angry at myself and even resentful towards the person. So like when I walked away from that situation in that vlog, I didn't hate him. I accepted him for who he was and I accepted that we have different personalities. That's why I left that in the video because I wanted my jewels to know that you can have standards and you can walk away. And for the TMI, I did have expectations that day because we planned it days in advance. And like Planning dinner wasn't an option. Like he said he was gonna do it. I really wanted him to enjoy the day too. That's why I planned it on a schedule because at that time Korea had a curfew so you had to make sure you have enough time to go home. I treated him to his cafe drink and also mall exhibition thingy was free. So like he didn't really have to worry about anything else but having to enjoy the schedule that we made together. And for me, my main goal was that even if we didn't have chemistry or we didn't connect, at least the actual contents of that day would be fun. Basically after the cafe and the mall, like I figured out what kind of person he was. I feel like I didn't no longer waste my time and his time. So it was actually a very easy decision. Maybe the way that I left should have been like less abrupt, but like I feel like it was the right thing to do. And I still feel that way because I, I don't hate him and I don't hate myself. So that's really good in my book. There's not a lot of moments in my life where I feel both feminine and powerful at the same time. But when I tried nails in Korea for the first time, that's when I felt that and like so I really want to do this more. Also about the hair situation in that video, I did like it but I just didn't want that lifestyle anymore. Hair blow dry for 30 minutes and like um, the bleach too so like basically it meant another another long period of time where my hair was damaged. Yeah, so even now I'm growing out the bleach again, so. Also the hair cell is actually famous if you guys didn't know. I was like, so happy to talk to him and meet him. Oh my gosh guys, her, her English bulldog is also called Mochi. I really want to create more memories of Mochi, so I have this picture, I think it's so cute. It's actually Ky Kylie Jenner, and I don't know, I just really like the vibe of this photo. This picture is really pretty, but it's not gonna fit on the board, so I'm gonna use it as wall decor. Finally, money. No explanation needed. Okay, my 2022 vision board is complete. When I look at this board, it does have the vibe of the life that I want, so it makes me really happy. And I really recommend my Jewel Studio because you could reuse this board all the time and printing pictures is so easy like if you could have your best life like why not and this is a good reminder every day apparently dream boards are meant to be seen by other people and me two years ago would have never done that yeah when i was in high school something really traumatic happened to me that like really made me afraid to tell people my plans or my goals basically like there was this opportunity that opened up and like i told my friend about it and she ended up i wouldn't say going behind my back but like she she found a way to take the opportunity before I did. And maybe she really needed needed it more than me, but uh, it really affected me in a way. But yeah, after that point in my life, I felt like I felt so scared. But I realized that if it's meant to be, it's meant to be. People who try to sabotage you or take things away from you or even like send you an evil eye, it's just gonna go back to them. Yeah, that's why I, I don't really care anymore. Who you really are is unlimited, which means absolutely nothing has power over. You. Smile, those delights I see will never return.